Hi everyone, this is Yvette from My World of Metaphysics. And if you're one of those people out there that's feeling like this year, every time I took one step forward, it seemed like I took five steps back. Every time that I tried to do something, it just seems like it didn't work. I feel like I have the whole world, my whole family on my back. And I want to know what is it that I can do to change my life, to get assistance. You landed on the right video. Today, I'm going to give you some powerful words that you can use every single morning that is going to change your life. These are words I personally use most of my life, and it has gotten me out of situation, out of situation, out of situation. But before we get started, if you've never heard of My World of Metaphysics, this is a metaphysical law of attraction channel that gives manifesting techniques in all different ways. The only thing I'm asking for you to do to support this channel is to like, subscribe, tap the bell, but most of all, just keep watching the videos. So now if you want to know what is it that I'm going to tell you that's going to change your life for good, keep watching. Now, what are the words that I'm going to tell you to use every single morning for at least one minute that's going to change your life? Now, listen, these words are powerful and they're good if you're trying to advance yourself in your career, love life, health, whatever it is. These words is going to get you out of trouble. If you need assistance with whatever it is you're doing, these words are going to help you. Listen, I have used these words over and over and over again, and it never failed. So I'm going to tell you what exactly you need to say and how to do it to transform your life. Now, these words are actually phrases that you can actually say within a minute. You don't have to use them all. You can pick which one resonates with you. So now, what is the words that I would tell you to use to change your life when you're in a situation, when you feel like your back is against the wall or you feel like you're not making movement? And that is, God, I give this to you. Now, how are we going to use these words? You're going to use these words by speaking to God as if God is your best friend, as if the universe is standing right in front of you. And you're going to state whatever it is that you want. And you're going to say, God, I give this to you. Why? Because you are releasing the issue. You're releasing the problem. You're releasing the condition, the negative condition that you no longer want in your life. When you hold on to something, you are saying, I am in control. I am the one that is causing everything to happen. And you're saying, the universe, God, I don't trust you. I don't believe in you. I know that anything that I get comes from me and not from you. So I have to handle this. But when you say, God, I give this to you, or universe, I give this to you, or Allah, I give this to you, remember, there is only one God. There is only one supreme being. It may be called many different names, but there's only one supreme being, okay? And on this video, I am using the word God, okay? But you can substitute for whatever higher power you use. So when you say these words, God, I give this to you, you're saying, God, I am releasing this situation to you. I no longer want to hold on to it. And I invite you. I give you permission to assist me. Now, when you say these words, you're saying it with sincerity, everyone. This is not something you come up with this, this morning and you're like, oh, you know what? I need a pair of shoes and, and you know what? I'm going to get them. I want that Louis bag, whatever. I want you to be sincere and serious about what it is that you want. The love of your life, better health, a, a career hike, a career boost, whatever it is that you want. You be serious about it and then you give it to God. And then you be patient because God is going to take care of it. The problem a lot of people have when it comes down to giving something to the universe or giving it to God is that they don't really believe and trust. They go looking over their shoulder every single minute, waiting, hunting, looking, lurking, 
to see when it's going to come. And when you do that, you are saying the total opposite of what you just said. God, I give this to you. Now, another tip that I want to give you guys, because you guys know I just love giving tips. You have to take action. God has to work through you to bring into your life whatever it is that you want. So you can't say, God, I give this to you, but I'm going to sit back and do nothing because I gave it to you. It does not work that way. If you want that job, you have to go put that resume in. If you want the love of your life, you need to get out of your house and go hang out with your friends or go to your favorite bookstore or wherever else you love to go. If you want to associate with better people, you need to get out there and go to places where other people are that you want to associate with. And God will use whatever you're doing to work through you to bring you that person, that condition, or that situation. It is just that simple. But when you say, God, I give this to you, you're letting go of the worry, of the guilt, of the depression, whatever it is associated with these negative conditions in your life, you are letting it go and you are trusting in the universe. Now that takes me in to the next phrase that you can use to actually receive guidance or protection or assistance from the universe. Besides using God, I give this to you. You can use the words after you speak to God, telling God what it is that you want. You can say, God, I release, I let go, and I trust. Aha, uh -huh. let me say that again. God, I release, I let go, and I trust. When you get up in the morning and you're looking in the mirror and you say, God, I see myself as being successful. I see myself as making six figures. I see myself helping my family. God, I know all of these things are possible. You said, I am the creator of my life. I made many steps. I'm asking you for guidance. I'm asking you to step into my life. I'm asking you to show me what it is I need to do and lead me in the direction of where it is I need to be. I need you to open up opportunities for me, God. And God, I am releasing this right now. God, I'm letting go because I can no longer be worried fearful about this because God, you already promised me. You told me everything is okay. So God, I am releasing. I'm letting go. And God, you know what? Finally, I am going to trust. I release, let go, and I trust. When you say this, you are opening up the doors for your life to change. I ask you to really know what it is that you want because you just supercharge whatever it is you're manifesting, whatever techniques you're using, whether it's scripting, affirmations, mirror work, whatever you're using that you're learning on this channel. You just supercharged it because you just gave it to your supplier. Now, what is another powerful quote that you can use in the morning that is going to supercharge whatever it is that you're doing at the same time get you out of any situation. And again, I'm telling you, I don't care what anyone is throwing at you. These words will change your life. And that is, with God, all things are possible. When you feel like you're in doubt, when you feel despair, when everyone has told you it cannot be done, when you sit there and it looks like nothing is working in your favor, when people are coming at you and you don't know what to do, you say to yourself, with God, all things are possible. Uh-huh. So that is saying, whatever it is I am looking at, whatever it is everyone else is saying, is not my reality. It is not my reality. God has already promised me whatever it is I want in my life for me to create the life that I desire right now, not tomorrow, not last year, but right now. And right now I state with God, all things are possible. And I'm telling you right now, when you pick your head up, and you walk like the queen or king that you are, and you say with God, all things are possible, and you let whatever anyone else is saying, let that be their reality, 
You are elevating your level of consciousness above those that don't believe. And it's going to take you very far. So now when you are going about your day and things seem like it's not going in your favor, you say to yourself, with God, all things are possible. And then you pick your head up and you know whatever it is you're seeing, whether it's going in your favor or not, God is working things out to bring you ahead. And a lot of times, it's higher than what you expected. It's more than what you expected. The whole thing is God knows more than you. The universe knows more than you. Maybe you're not supposed to be there. Maybe God is preparing you for something better. Maybe God wants you to get some more experience before the doors of abundance open up for you. Okay, everyone. This is Yvette from My World of Metaphysics, and I just gave you three powerful quotes that is going to change your life, that is going to remove any barrier, that is going to knock down any wall that is up against you in your life. Only thing I ask for you to do again is to like, subscribe, tap the bell, and most of all, you guys, keep watching the videos. If you like this channel and you wanna know all types of manifesting techniques, please join the membership and support this channel. Membership is a way of you saying, Yvette, I love your material and it is actually changing my life.